Well, it is March. That means the Greater Hartford St. Patrick's Day Parade coming up on this Saturday. And we are covering it all right here on Fox 61 and our sister station, the CW20. Joining me right now is one of this year's Celtic Scholars, Veronica McKenna from Wethersfield, a senior at Wethersfield High School. Hi. A pleasure to meet you. you How too. are you today? I'm good. How are you? Good, good, good. First of all, congratulations. Thank you. I appreciate it. How does it feel to be named a Celtic Scholar? It feels good. You know, I'm very Irish. We, our family's Irish. It's <laughs> It's, it's it's nice, and I'm so grateful for this opportunity. Okay, well, I'm going to ask you, what did you do to get named a Celtic scholar? I've got a list of your accomplishments <laughs> right here. We'll go through it, but I'd rather have you tell us. Okay, well, um, I did Irish step dance for ten years, mm -hmm. um, which that that's a long time. I danced in which school, by the way? Because there's oh we, Griffith we have a, Academy. There you go. Okay, Shout out. Yep. Shout yeah. out. Um, <laughs> no, it was it's great. Like I've just grown up with my family being Irish, yep. and you know it's something we celebrate, something we it's it's just our um, heritage. Yeah. It's good. Yeah. yeah. And I always like to ask, especially with younger generations, because mm -hmm. as you get one more generation in this country, the meaning of heritage sometimes yeah. tends to change, it gets blended. If you're like me, I'm a whole mix of heritages. Yeah. I got a little bit of Irish in me. Yeah. But yeah, this is, you're McKenna, you are all Irish all the no. way. No, <laughs> we, we have a lot of things. My mom's Polish and Hungarian, my <gasps> dad's a lot of things. Dad? You didn't tell us that. Yeah, he's the <laughs> bad guy right there. Yeah, well, we're like Italian too. Yeah. Um, but yeah, our last name really puts it on display it for right you. It is right there, yes. Mm -hmm. And of course, the scholar part of the Celtic Scholar, you're a member of the National Honor Society, yeah. going to Eastern Connecticut State University yeah. in the fall, yeah. playing field hockey. Yeah. <laughs> uh, what are your ambitions there? I really want to become a physical education teacher. Mm -hmm. My grandpa was one. Um, I'll be the first Irish woman in my family to graduate from college if I go through with it. That's which wonderful. Hopefully I will. Um, I have a feeling yeah, you will. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, it's exciting. Yeah, I, I, I bet. So what is parade day going to look like for you? Well, I'm going to wake up. Um, I'll probably put on a bunch of green mm -hmm. stickers, Good clothes, yep. makeup, um, and then we'll head off to the Capitol, get in line, and then march down. I love seeing the people on the sides because I've danced in it for years. Yeah. So I like I know what I'm in for, but I, just, <laughs> I love the excitement. I love all the all the people. Just even if you're not Irish, everyone's Irish on St. Patrick's Day. Like, it's great. I it's agree. Fun. You yeah. know, even just sort of walking around last year, there weren't quite as many people still mm -hmm. kind of, you know, bad weather. Uh, they had to COVID postpone still, it the, and yeah. the COVID hangover. I bet you this year those streets are just going to be mobbed. I'm excited. People. My whole family is coming out. We're, we're going to cheer our hearts out because us Irish are... We can get rowdy. Uh, <laughs> but, yeah. but it's all good things, you know? <laughs> yeah. Uh, I see you're a member of the uh, school's Future Educators mm -hmm. Club. Tell me about that. Yeah, so I'm the secretary. Mm -hmm. um, it's great. We go on field trips. We get into schools. We teach everything. Um, it's it's just my, my whole family has been teachers. Right. And it's something that I want to do. And so by joining this club, I... Um, you know, I tried to to get a peek into what the what the job is like, you know? And I found an interesting factoid just a few minutes ago. Oh, no. It's not just you and your brother who's at Weathersfield High School. Yes. Both of your parents are there yes. now working too. Yes. What is that like? <laughs> I mean, it's not bad for me because, well, I have a very supportive family. But um, it's kind of nice because during my study halls, I just go to their classrooms. I eat all their food. Um, it's, it's great. You know, it keeps me on track. It keeps yeah. me having good grades, everything. <laughs> yeah, I imagine. And you were doing a great job. Thank I'm sure you. you're going to make your family, you're going to make Weathersfield proud, you're going to make the you. parade proud, and congratulations Thank you so again. much. I really it's appreciate it. It's been a pleasure it. to meet you. Thank you. You too. And uh, you can see her and just celebrate with all of us here. Fox 61 and CW20, of course, proud partners of the 51st annual Greater Hartford St. Patrick's Day Parade coming up this Saturday. Join us at 11 a.m. on our sister station, CW20. But also keep in mind it's going to be streaming on Fox 61+. Plus. Bundle up in the green. We can't wait to see you there.